Hi there, HDR Light Studio 5.4 introduces repositionable light handles. Uh, here we've got uh, our current light and when we move this on the canvas uh, it's moved by its centre. There's always been an orange dot in the centre of lights in HDR Light Studio and this is the handle you move it with. Uh, 5.4 introduces a repositionable handle so if we come into the light preview and I drag down here and I drag it to the bottom of the light there if I then click on my model I'm now positioning that light by its edge this can be really useful for certain types of uh, shots like cars or where you need a, a specific gradient starting from a, a particular position this is really handy um, so as well as working with the lights like this you could have say these people that have been added to the map and you may want to position them but rather than position them from you know their center you may say want to just like move that to the top of his head and then wherever you click you're dragging that by the top of his head um, so again that makes it quite useful it could be any specific detail uh, in a piece of content you want to add and you want to kind of anchor it by a place you can now do that and then if we look at this HDRI map that we've loaded in the background here and uh, what I want to do is I want to kind of position the Sun in a particular area of the model what we can do not only can you move the the handle by dragging in the light preview we have uh, two sliders they can be reset by double clicking and that gets it centered as with any of the sliders now in version 5.4 double clicking will reset them to their default value so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to move this slider until it's aligned with the Sun which you can see down there and I'm then going to use light paint to click on the area of the model where I want the Sun to shine and then this is obviously moved this planar content up in the air so all I need to do is double click on the latitude slider and that brings it back down so that was just a little um, simple way you can use the handle uh, to help you position the HDRI map as well uh, with respect to your model Another thing to note about when moving the light handle is that the HDRI map uh, dynamically updates so you can actually have very interactive uh, feedback as you move that handle. And another thing is that when uh, a rotation is applied it is actually rotated around the handle position. So as you move where the handle is that rotation has been applied um, based on that handle position. So that's something that's very useful to know. Another great thing about being able to position the light handle is if we were to say have this gradient of light, so I move it up to here and position this on this model and I rotate it, it will rotate around that handle. Okay. So imagine this was some earphones or you know some kind of product and we wanted that kind of grad of light. If uh, I move the handle to the edge here we then can position this by its top edge. So now the cool thing is if I then scale the light it scales from the handle position which is really useful. So in this case actually it would have been better to leave uh, the handle in the middle of the light. So I can position it here and then as I scale that that kind of grows in both directions and then I can change the brightness of that. I can Okay, there you go, change that. So basically where I click, I can just tweak and rotate. And as I say scale the height of the light, it is scaled from that edge. So I'm kind of bringing that detail in and then I'm bringing that detail out. And the entire light doesn't have to move to do that because it's... Uh, 
it is positioned and it's held in place by the handle at the top there. Uh, so if you were to say, you know, lighting a car, let's get rid of the rotation on that. And then we'll say, get it totally turned upside down, that's it. And you might have this reflecting in the side of a vehicle. And then you want to uh, change the height of that detail. And you can just kind of scale that and it is positioned, it's anchored by that edge. 